Hi, I'm home improvement expert Lou Manfredini. You know, cold weather is coming, and with the chill comes the need to winterize your home for comfort and efficiency. Now, here are some simple steps for staying warm and saving money this winter. Now, in the winter, your furnace is the engine that drives your comfort level and your budget. And like the engine in your car, it needs to be tuned to run its best. So let's continue with the car analogy. How many of you have the training to conduct a full inspection and tune-up of your vehicle? Now, I know that most of us can check the oil and replace the occasional burned out light bulb, but could you check the fuel injector, the belts, the hoses, and know exactly what to look for? Well, the same can be said for your furnace. Most of us can wipe down the outside of the unit and change the filter. That's something that should be done monthly, not just seasonally. But how many of us are really qualified to dig into the electrical and mechanical parts of the furnace? You should be contacting a local heating and cooling contractor who's licensed and have them do a thorough cleaning and tune-up of the unit. This simple step could save you nearly 5% on your winter heating costs. If you have older inefficient windows or you're tired of wrestling with storm windows and screens every year, this is the time to consider replacing them with new energy efficient windows from a top manufacturer like Marvin. Many replacement windows qualify for a federal tax credit of up to $1,500 and will also save you as much as 15 to 25% on your monthly heating and cooling bills. So have you ever heard of a blower door test? Basically, they attach this big fan on your front door. They turn it on and create pressure to determine where the air is leaking in your home. Now, depending on the size of the individual gaps and cracks, you'll want to seal them using caulk, weather stripping, or expandable insulating foam. The air flowing through these small cracks and leaks can add up to big energy losses. In a poorly sealed house, it can have the same impact as a two-foot square window open all winter long. You can do a simple version of this test yourself. Just hold a lighted candle near the edge of your window and door frames. If the flame wavers and flickers, that's a sign that you're losing energy and dollars through those poorly sealed gaps. The next step is insulating the attic and sealing off the joist space between the attic and the rest of the house. Heat rises, so a poorly insulated attic means you'll lose a great deal of heat through the attic and roof. Proper insulation can cut your heating and cooling bills dramatically. So once your furnace is running at maximum efficiency, your home is properly insulated and the drafts have been eliminated, you should consider adding a programmable thermostat to your system. With a programmable thermostat, you can regulate the temperature inside your home to provide comfort during the time you're home and adjust the temperature when you're away or sleeping. By following these steps, you can ensure a comfortable home and a higher comfort level with your energy budget. I'm Lou Manfredini. Thanks for watching.